time. You are not finished yet. You are not finished yet. The only thing that you have, you are left to do, is to turn to this mighty God, the one who created all things, the one who has the power to bring into existence even things that do not exist. He can open a door for you just one day. A single day, one door will bring you to where you should be. Amen? Amen. But He is waiting on you and me to turn our heart to Him and acknowledge where we fell, where we fell, the wrong choices and the decisions that we made that brought us to where we are. God is waiting on us to acknowledge that we were wrong Amen. and that we need His help. Amen? Yeah. If God is able to sustain the earth, if He is able to sustain the plantation, the animals in the field, the birds in the air, the fish in the sea, if He is able to keep the sun in this place and it's never falling down, He is able to take care of you. Amen? Yeah. God is able to take care of you. He is only waiting for your honesty. Your honesty to acknowledge that God, I was wrong and I need you. Help me out. And God will help you. He has power to restore you. He has power to make you think new. He said in his word that even when you are walking in darkness, he is able to cause light to shine in your way. Amen. He is able to cause the crooked places to become straight for you. He has done it for so many people. Now it's your turn. Amen. It is your turn to turn to Him and say, Lord, I need you. I know you can help me. Help me out. Help me out. He loves you so much. He loves you so much that He sent His Son to come and die and go through so many pain and suffering for you. Because he knew that by a decision, by a choice, you will come to a place like this. And he gave the sign that when it happens and you turn to him, you bring restoration in your life. Hallelujah. Are you ready for the Lord to bring some change in your life? If you are, I want you to step forward right now. God is able to help you. Step forward right now. Step forward right now. Amen. God is waiting Amen. on you. God is waiting Amen. on you. Your life is not ended yet. Your glory, your expectation, your desire is not dead yet. It's still waiting. It's still waiting. It's still waiting. It's only in the flesh that your choice has made you come to where you are. But He's wait, waiting on you. Amen. Amen. If you want God to help you, step forward. He's ready to help you. He's the God of restoration. He has power. His power, His power caused many things to happen. His power sustains the earth. His power sustains the sun and the moon and everything that we can see around. The wind blows, you don't know where it comes from, but it blows and you bring every day. It's God who is doing it. And it can bring freshness into your life. It can bring newness into your life. I want you to step forward and He will touch you. Amen? Amen. Anybody here that wants God to restore Him? Anybody here? You need God's restoration? Hallelujah. God is waiting for you to come forward. Just to turn to Him. And you show Him that He has been waiting for you all this time. All this time He's been waiting on you. Amen. We have an enemy out there who wants to destroy our lives. But God says, this is the place that I want you to be. This is the life that I want you to live. So you'll be protected from Him. And God is the protector. He can protect you. He can protect you from the evil one who wants to destroy our lives. Come forward and He will touch you. Amen. Come forward and He will touch you. He loves you. He loves you. I'm here to tell you that God loves you. He loves you so much. Bless me your name. Bless me your name. Thank you, brother. Thank you, brother. Amen. In the name of 
Jesus Christ. I curse the virus to come out of your stomach right now. In the name of Jesus, I bind you virus and I declare you dead, every one of you dead and out of this body in the name of Jesus Christ. And I declare every power of the enemy that troubles your life bound and come out of your life. And I speak restoration into your life right now. In the name of Jesus, be restored and restore to your family, restore to your society, restore to your home, restore to your job. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray, I pray gladness in your mind that you may be able to catch what God is saying to you, where He wants you to go, the church that He wants you to go for your complete restoration right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you.